The humidity levels in your home can actually play a large role in the health of you and your family. Ideally, you want to maintain the humidity between 40 and 60%. Anything above 60% can lead to increased sickness, increased allergies, increased chemical interactions, and much more. One of the harmful effects of high humidity is the increased spreading of airborne sickness throughout your home. This is due to the fact that higher humidity leads to a higher survival rate of bacteria and viruses. When you keep your home in the ideal humidity range of 40 to 60 percent, you can actually weaken the cells of bacteria and viruses, making it less likely for them to survive in your home. Another side effect of high humidity in your home is the increased likelihood of you and your family experiencing allergies. Fungi and dust mites are two of the most common causes of allergies, and incidentally, both of these increase as the humidity levels increase. This means that the higher the humidity level in your home, the more likely you are to experience allergies. In addition to allergies and sickness, high humidity can also increase the chances of chemical reactions throughout your home. For instance, many chemicals found in building materials are water-soluble. This means that as the humidity increases, the chances of off-gassing of chemicals is more likely to occur. As the chart illustrates, there is an optimum humidity zone of 40 to 60% relative humidity. By keeping your home in this level, you can help avoid unnecessary sickness, allergies, and chemical interactions.